The very thing you want most is the very thing you're afraid to open up to on some level, Jem. You seem to express stability, family, happiness, divine love, but, but you are afraid to express your feelings or you will never receive properly what you deserve. I'm worried that it might happen. Some of you have someone you love, but you haven't been able to express your feelings yet, or if you do, it always seems like the timing is wrong. The spirit is telling me, there is no right time either you worry about it all the time, or you take the leap of faith that can always be achieved through divine signs. If this is love, it's mutual here and you both think everything the same about each other. Opposites and all, some kind of conversation or apology needs to happen, but someone doesn't feel heard or accepted and that's the furthest thing from the truth. You can either stay the same and miss this opportunity, or you can trust this connection and take the plunge and do what you both want, a fresh start. If it is not love, then whatever this is, you must believe that it is achievable. Please ask, at Salgadiso999 is my only account, Nainau Manra I see you're looking for someone new, or you already have someone in mind, and I know you care invest in them as you would invest in, treat others with compassion and consideration, but you may be holding on to past loves or karma. B. Family, friends, work, things you need to let go of and know are not good for your health cancer, knows who these people are without second guessing. You intuitively know that you may dream about these people or simply have strange feelings when you are near them. In any case, know these, people have to go, but they are blocking your happiness mainly because, people aren't happy and they don't want to see you happy. I am, you know your value and value but unfortunately you want everyone to use you as an energy source, no matter who it is, they are only there to play my game, bring up past traumas and... I see that you're going through a whole revamp of your life Scorpio, you could have experienced a horrible breakup, actual physical, death somehow, near-death experiences slash or been fighting off, this transformation, ego death, or spiritual awakening for quite, some time, to assist with waking your ass up now that you, surrendered to it, things are looking up because you're trusting, your intuition the sign spirit guides more realizing that, bliss is abundant in your life you've learned how, Cause effect slash, karma works. You're learning to stand on your own two feet, receive the intergalactic confirmation you're constantly getting, realizing how divinely guided protected you are. You're, channeling a whole different energy, one that's more healing, transcendent in alignment with where you're headed. You're, Co-creating a lot more because you found the key actually, start using it, you've always had the key but some at times you like, your lessons hard Scorpio we all go through that stage every, so often but I see that you've learned what was needed now, the focus is mastering your solo magic. No more acting or masks just being authentically you. Chanting while meditating, writing a gratitude list will be very beneficial for you, at Salgodisk 999 is my only account.